Welcome to the hobby shop. Come on in. Got a couple projects we're working on here. One of them is the uh, new geothermal uh, circulation system. This is the pump and the uh, bladder can. That's the air bleeder. It's going out here. The field's going out here in the backyard. We'll show you that in a minute. Right now we're working on laying out the board that's going to mount the pump and the valves and all of the uh, equipment that operates it. And uh, over here we've got some fittings and tube to uh, put all this together with. We've been working with these little mounts to uh, mount the stuff down. But uh, one of the situations is that the uh, big old bladder can here, big old bladder can makes it need to stand away from the wall pretty far. The mount board. So we're coming up with ideas like that. We'll see. Well, out here is the, um, the field. Each of these double pipes is a, uh, a well hole drilled down about 15 to 20 feet. This one here was about 20. The rest of them started hitting rock. So we've got seven, eight of them in so far. Two more to go. I'm going to go right here. And then the greenhouse is going to go across the whole back of the garage. The field will be underneath the greenhouse. They're going to share the heat. We'll heat the field with the warm greenhouse. And the warm ground will bring up that heat and heat the greenhouse with it. That's a win-win, eh? Okay. Well, this here is the drill string. This is the bit. This is uh, an adapter. I think I glued on. And then this is just a, well, it's a nipple, inch and a half. It's all inch and a half pipe, I believe. And um, yeah, we just hacksawed some slits in that. Bent it out this way and that way. We got it going and out. We got them going in. We got them going twisty. So whatever gets in the way, that sucker's gonna be wanting to bite on it, so. And uh, this thing is 18 feet long. A little unwieldy when you start, because it's a way up in the air. And when you're done drilling a hole, this is your rotator bar. That's all the way up at the top. It's all the way up in the top because Oh, that's way down in the ground. And this is where the water comes in. A couple adapters. This is just pushed on there. In fact, sometimes it pops off. So yeah, that's how it's done. When you stand it up to start drilling another hole. Well, I'll show you all that. We'll get around to it. This is the extension pipe that we use when we drilled this first hole, this one. And, uh, yeah, we got way down there on that one. We were like 22, 23 feet on that hole. So, yep, two more to go. And then uh, we'll be piping all of these together and running them inside the building. And uh, I'll show you the radiator. Hold on. Where would you be without a plan, huh? Well, this is, uh, this is going to move the water around that field you just saw. This is the radiators. These are one inch. Openings on this. It's good and thick. And uh, 19 by 20 inches. One inch outlets. We're going to just duct tape a 
box fan to one side of it for now. And then uh, get everything working and then we'll build a cabinet for it. So that's what's going on right now. I'm going to tune you back in when we get a, to drilling those last two holes and we'll get some, we'll get some film on it. Yeah, all this stuff was, uh, came from Menards and uh, Home Depot came from a lot of supplies. Got the radiator online.